Hey everyone, happy uh, President's Day, I believe it is. There's been quite a lot of public holidays already. I didn't realize there was so many in the US, but um, that's a good thing though. If you get a day off from work, that's good. You can study, relax a little bit, study, chart analysis. Anyway, what I'm going to do is review... Um, <clears throat> this must have been from Friday, I'm assuming. Because I didn't see this... Um, hmm. Because I didn't open up stock to trade on Saturday or Sunday. Um, Sunday, I just went over my review of how I went for the week. And I was down around $30 odd dollars. But um, this is interesting. There's not really... Oh, wow, well, that's going to be interesting to watch. I watch a lot of YouTube in between waiting for trades to happen and everything like that, especially relevant considering um, Tim's latest video that he put up about being patient and waiting for setups. And I uh, totally agree with that. Even for, you know, from my Forex background, there's a lot of that, honestly. Um, I guess I'll just review what I was looking at. And um, MBRX, they did the financing on Friday, obviously, so that's <clears throat> trickled down. I mean, the, uh, the volume was still okay, though, but... Yeah, they did the financing, which is fair enough. You know, they did it at 210 or something. Um, FTFT had a descend. Right, and then down, 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 down. Uh, I guess, you know, MGTI might be a talking point. It was pretty flat uh, to finish. Had a training. Oh, why not? Actually, sorry, the range was a little bit higher than I thought. Maybe 20 cents a share range, high of 250 yard. Yeah, so, I mean, it doesn't, it can get very caught in a bit of a box MGTI so there's not really a lot to talk about I see this you know my bounce off 220 Bitcoin is uh, I'll check on this again I think it's near 11,000 we have to go to bed soon as well Yeah, pretty much. So it's back at near 11,000. So we'll see uh, how this goes here. I mean, 11,500 there. So it's interesting. Um, you know, everything slowed down a lot. So, I, <clears throat> and I'm not doing swing trades. I'm still not really comfortable doing that. So I guess uh, oh, MBRX, MBVX. All right. Okay. That's a, a lot. I might just bring that chart up just as a point of having some content to talk about. It seems that you know the crypto, Bitcoin, blockchain plays and the weed stocks are a little bit flat. Um, PTN last week moved a little bit. Um, okay. Interesting. Uh, okay, some news I'll look into. Interesting. Got listed on the NASDAQ, perhaps. There might have been something. The real stock split to regain compliance with NASDAQ's $1 minimum bid price maintenance requirement. Okay, well, how about that? I guess, you know, um, I will put out a watch list tomorrow night at about 9.30ish. So that's going to be, um, they'll be 8.30 in the morning New York time. But other than that, there's not really a lot to talk about. It's just you've got to be patient. You've got to be picky. Um, react to what's moving as well. If it does fit the pattern, take the trade. Don't hesitate too much. If it doesn't, you know, no deal. So that's the video, guys. You know, apologies for the lack of clarity, but, you know, you just got to wait and react to what's going on. Okay, bye for now guys. Happy trading.